Good morning, good afternoon, and a very good evening to you all, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Metal Gear Rising. You are here with Morris and Raiden, and at the end of the last part, we just defeated Sam, and now we're headed to, uh, to Pakistan for the final level. And, um... What, what am I drinking out here, you ask? Well, I'll tell you. Yeah, I'll just, I just have the bottle for you here. It's um, Sainsbury's Still Lemon and Lime Flavored Spring Water Drink. It's a hot day, so I thought I might as well have this. No added sugar. Of course, the flavorings used in this product are made from natural sources. Sounds good. This drink is made with spring water sourced from the deep beneath the lush green countryside of the Brecon Beacons. Well, I have no idea where Brecon is, but I'm sure the Beacons are lovely this time of year. And that's not a euphemism. Alrighty. So let's get cracking, shall we? Boom! That's one, baby. Don't scream. It's unbecoming. Wow. This is a weird angle to be doing this from. <laughs> I get that other guy? Oh, I did a little bit. I got one of his arms. You know, you might you can't do this without being seen, but nah. Not really much point. Hmm. Unless you're going for the trophy, which requires it. Alas, I am not. You see that? Their exit codes show up as unaffiliated. Wait, Marshall has the security contract for this base. Why would they have their cyborg set to the same illegal EXIF code as Desperado? It's evidence against them. No, it's their alibi. They're making it look like Desperado hacked their soldiers on sight because everyone knows Desperado has a contract with... The Pakistani rebels. Oh, but if we go public with the desperado Marshall connection... Oh, look at that glow on my sword there, that's now nice. Got this nice big foreign threat all <laughs> that angle, oh, service. beautiful. Greens, the oranges, the that's nice. Be able to resist. Courtney, can you see this? This is just beautiful. Damn it, you're right. It's another slam dunk. What about any humans on the base? Marshall only handled security. Dead, most likely. Or brain jacked, if they needed them to keep up appearances. Uh, they'd never publicize what airport the president was flying into, not in this region. And almost no one would have access to an outside line for security reasons. It wouldn't be difficult to keep things hush-hush, at least until Air Force One arrives. I'm heading for the control tower. If I can destroy the antenna array, the U.S. military will know something's wrong. Good idea. Be careful. Sam's gone, and I blew the winds of destruction away. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. It's a good line. I blew the winds of destruction away. I like it. Raiden, there is no time to worry You're pretty about good, the Raiden. You think Get on the, the spot these lines, now. you know? Why was I in the air then? <laughs> oh, that ninja run. Alright, I want to kill this guy. Oh, wrong one. Come on. Does this buddy really not notice me? I want the trophy. Normally I just say, you know, screw it, but I want the trophy. I'm sorry. It's gotta be done. Oh! <laughs> nice! And your friend. Whoa! See how accurate those RBGs are from a distance? Come on. Woo! You can slice the rocket in midair, but. I don't know, they travel pretty friggin' fast. I don't like to take that chance, to be honest. Come on, security cameras, you can't do anything to me. There's nothing up there, what am I doing? I'm just wasting time now. This stage has a pretty nice music as well, actually. It builds up the tension quite nicely, I think. Mm 
No, you don't. Don't swear at me. Ooh, just in time. <laughs> well, that guy wipes the floor with me. And again, there's some more heavies in here, so... I want to clear the floor, really. Whoa, out of the depths of nothing. Here comes the first one. Oh my god, I forgot that move tracks you. <laughs> Look at them desperately attempting to jump over me. These can be troublesome to fight in groups, but as long as you keep piling on the pressure, you got no problem. See what I mean? You can't get a just defend on them, I don't think. Which, you know, makes sense, actually. <laughs> Considering how insanely powerful they are. Oh, thank you. But it's a bit late, Doc. I don't think I'm gonna need it after this. Let's be honest. This is this is end game stuff now. Where am I going? <laughs> Trying to remember where the secrets is. <laughs> I think I might have missed one already, actually. Oh well, I'm not going back. Would you just, would you just jump up there, please? Please just jump up there, right? And that'd be, that'd be fantastic. There we go. Oh, that'll do. Oh well, at least I end the game with full health. That's, that's a nice bonus. <laughs> surveillance cameras. Oh, just, you know, why not? Just slice them up. Just slice them up. Just, like, get those combos. <laughs> oh, I really shouldn't fight this guy first. Again, these, uh... When you fight on stairs, it can kind of get a bit, uh, annoying. Oh, you cheeky son of a bitch. <laughs> like, I have to get rid of you first. Oh, who knows where we're going. We're just inside the scenery. <laughs> Sometimes you just don't know where you're going to land in this game. Oh, I don't think so. That step back was your last mistake. Something tells me there's a guy in a box hiding behind you. Another MIB? Listen, oh. we have to forget we ever saw this, okay? Huh. My instincts were correct. My god, Wolf! You'll die as the proud wolf you are. I'm um, joking, he doesn't die. That wouldn't make any sense considering I chopped him up once before and he still came back. <laughs> What's going on? An earthquake. Oh crap. Oh! This makes zero sense. <laughs> I'll just come out and say it right now. This is the new Metal Gear, by the way. <laughs> it's 
case anybody was wondering what this monstrosity is. It's actually... I mean, I, I at first I thought it was that thing from uh, Wild Wild West. They have an 80-foot tarantula. <laughs> but nope, it's metal gear. But it makes no sense! Why would it come from the ground? The floor! The, 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 clearly from a place it's not built to house it. Like, it doesn't have an exit maneuver other than to destroy the base it's in. But hell, whatever, maybe maybe this guy was just too impatient. I'm strong. Well, if it isn't Saucy Jack. No one calls me that anymore. Just a little too late. Not since my stripper days. As usual. I'm strong. Impressive little toy you've got there. But your plan ends here. <laughs> Idiot. Hey. You're not ending our plan. You're expanding it. Check the internet lately. <laughs> Check your emails lately. Air Force One is turning back to the States. What? How'd they know? Someone posted photos of what's happening on the base. The whole world is up in arms. Twitter's going crazy. How did they? Hashtag Metal Gear. Story leaked early, then Marshall's plan is ruined. The hell it is. Look what they're saying. The story I got a feeling Google Glass will one day look like this. <laughs> oh yeah, because people take just benign comments seriously on the internet, don't they? By Americans. Besides, a few dozen soldiers is tragic. But nothing to start a major war over. That's just a spark, son. The excuse we've been waiting for. America's wanted this war for years. The Patriots, they knew war was good for the economy. Four years later, their legacy lingers on. The memes. They left us their great isms. Nationalism. Unilateralism. Materialism. Racism. For those Wait, no, that's a bad one. Forget about that. <laughs> Give yourself up to the whole. No need to better yourself. You're American. You're number one. Then the only value left is dollar value. The economy. So we'll do whatever it takes to keep it humming along. Even war. Especially war. Bullshit. The Patriots planted the seed. We don't need them around to filter and foster their memes any longer. We're spreading them just fine ourselves. Every American man, woman, and child. We're all sons of a Patriots now! Only an American politician can pull this kind of thing off. You have an English politician, they don't have the charisma to be able to do something like this. <laughs> since the fall of SOP. <laughs> and the military costs? Wasting billions is going to help the economy? DMCs, arms manufacturers, job creators, Jack. All those workers spending money, paying taxes. Trust me, a little war can work wonders. So grease the gears with some innocent blood, is that it? Oh, relax, Jack. It's a war on terror. We're not out to kill civilians. Extremists! Lawless gangs, madmen. Of course, that would have to include you. Wouldn't want any eyewitness reports complicating the message. Look at that, you can control this thing with, the, you know, just a couple of joysticks and a few pedals. Wow, technology. Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> and it screams because all Metal Gears are designed to scream in some way. <laughs> Alrighty, well, I gotta pause it for now, guys. But thank you very much for watching this. I know, I'm sorry, but I, I gotta prevent my laptop from exploding and myself. Oh, God!
But thank you very much for watching this episode of Metal Gear Rising. And please do join me for the next one, guys. I don't think I need to give you another reason to come back. <laughs> See you later. Oh, God. <laughs>